A mechanically stabilised layer incorporating a tensile triax geogrid has been shown to outperform a granular layer incorporating a tensile biaxial geogrid. At the heart of this improved trafficking performance is the shape of the triax geogrid itself. Extensive research has allowed Tensar to understand how different geogrids affect the performance of roadways under repeated heavy traffic loading. And these tests have confirmed that the geogrid component of a mechanically stabilised layer needs to effectively respond to the load pattern passing through the roadway itself. At Tensar, we have confirmed the load passing from a wheel through a road construction is conical, radiating 360 degrees from the point of contact. So when the load encounters a geogrid, the footprint is near circular. Here's how we can see that. Recent tests using TechScan pressure monitoring seem to confirm that this is the case. Here, on the right, we see a wheel passing over the surface of a granular layer. At its base is the TechScan pressure mat, which produces a real-time pressure map from the wheel travelling at the surface shown on the left. This pressure map shows how the effect of the wheel is felt at the base of the granular layer at geogrid level and shows the near circular footprint as shown by the flattened red circle. The hexagonal shape of a triax geogrid matches this loading pattern more closely than the square shape of the tensar biaxial geogrid. Extensive full-scale trafficking trials as well as over 10 years of successful project application, have confirmed the improved performance of a tensile mechanically stabilised layer, including tensile triax geogrids. And with our greater understanding of the imposed load through the layers of a road construction, we've developed design methodology to give performance-based proposals to deal with traffic loading encountered every day. So as you can see, it's the unique shape of tensile triax that makes the difference.